watching Sean Alexander getting some PT and doing quite well. Second quarter tied at seven. 17 yards down to the Kansas City 37. Alexander again, another 17 yards to the Kansas City 20. 74 yards rushing on the night. 54 yards on this drive, which he caps off with a seven yard touchdown. Waters likes it. On the Seahawks' next possession, Sean Alexander. He's coming up the middle, and he scores. The Seahawks go for two. They miss. It's 24-19. Touchdown from Trent Dilfer, and the Seahawks lead at home 7-3. Ricky Waters out. Could be month. Could be two months. Sean Alexander, second year back. How did he do? Pretty well. 14 yards, 14 three so. Mac would not play anymore today. Yeah, but Sean Alexander did. Three-yard touchdown on the flubber. 21-12. Seabags. Last week. He's off and running three minutes into the game. Outstanding blocking at the line of scrimmage, but watch number 82, Daryl Jackson, and look at the patience of Alexander as he waited on the block. If he goes in front of him, he doesn't drive all year despite the fact. Third quarter, open up seven. Alexander gets the call and the draw. Touchdown. Six yards out with five to 20. Quarter different score, quarter same story. First and goal. And it's Alexander from 10 yards out. 243 yards rushing with three touchdowns. Here we go again. Alexander running outside. Sean for 12 yards. And so in comes Sean Alexander. Pretty good to have him off the yeah. bench, Tom. He's already gained 1,000 yards this year, the second year back. And he's in. Touchdown. Yesterday when they would stay in it, well, a year ago, uh, question, who do you draft when you came to the pick? Ron Game was drafted by the Giants ahead of Sean Alexander, both first round picks. Alexander now starting in because Ricky Waters is hurt. Wow. 29 yards, 7 nothing. Falls on it. And then the little dump off. Matt Hassel back to Sean Alexander. Look at him. Motor 16 yards. Seattle leads 24 17. Wide receiver here going to do a great job of stealing the outside. Just watch him. He comes in. Right here, you want to stay up and get your seal right there. And Sean Alexander is off to the races. Alexander, 20 carries, 127 yards. Meanwhile, the Seahawks hold on to win it. Seattle now from the 24-yard line begins this drive. Sean Alexander breaking one. One guy to beat. And he's the guy who knocks him down. Ronnie Hurd was the last man between Alexander and the goal line. And it's probably the easiest in the fourth quarter. And you can see right now, well, that was a heck of a block right there, but it's starting to get easier for the Seahawks right now. And that last drive was easier for the 49ers. 42 yards, taking it to the 34-yard line. Arizona, Sean Alexander. It's a tough five-yard run. The Seahawks, who lost at home to Arizona, lead at 10-3. When they can't tackle Green, 28-25, Seattle up by just three. But then Sean Alexander does go off the way. 46 yards for him. 39, 30. 98 on the 27th, Sean Alexander. And then it all said you got the rise up coming. Alexander, eight 100-yard game. Our game in a good December. Walter Jones came in last week. Pro Bowl tackle, gets some blocking. And Sean Alexander with the run on the same drive. So they weren't sure what kind of line they would have here, but Alexander says, give me a little bit of daylight. I'm going to die for the one. He ends up scoring, makes it. They don't. Corn Robinson is gone. And then second quarter, Hasselbeck screen to Alexander. Alexander's ragtime band. He had a pair of touchdowns, 108 yards rush. Over the last scope here at plus. 14-7, and here's Sean Alexander. He's back. The Seahawks congratulate him on being a dad, and he's handing out cigars right here. The 12-yard run. Seahawks. Bobby Douglas. It's a it's a two-point conversion at 17 all. But Sean Alexander busts it open with this 25-yard run. The Seahawks lead for the new Papa. Well, new as in the season, new Papa. Sean Alexander touchdown. 23-13 Seahawks. They've lost 20 straight road games. Third longest streak in football history. Sean Alexander, gone, almost gone. 55 yards, sets up a Hasselbeck touchdown run. 7-0, next play. Sean Alexander, off left tackle. 10 yards to the two. Alexander from the two, touchdown, 
22. Meanwhile, the Seattle Seahawks still 57 yards only rushing for McAllister. Meanwhile, Matt Hasselbeck. How about that throw to Sean Alexander and Alexander's marching band does the rest. Into the end zone, touchdown, 7-0 Seahawks. Still same score, second quarter, Seattle at the six. And Alexander with a whoop, and then a whoop, and then a whoop. That's lucky <laughs> to Bucky Jones, unlucky from New Britain, Connecticut. Touchdown, 14-0 Seahawks. Third quarter. Seahawks up 14-7, Seattle at the nine, and again Alexander zipping outside. Three touchdowns for Alexander, 21-7 Seattle. Br brilliant run, seeing the cutback lane, but unfortunate right here, Boom. But a injury here, and this looked awful. I mean, he went, that's a turf injury. Look, the Seahawks on a long flight as we speak. So the word is right. One saying you ain't seen n -n 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 nothing yet. Sean Alexander and the Seahawks undefeated at home last year. That's Grant Wistrom saying hi to former teammates before the game, but he knows the tendency of St. Louis. And he knows that Sean Alexander's one-yard run has very early in the game put the Seahawks up 7-0. On the play, and two plays later, it's Sean Alexander who moves up and gets out of bounds. And then the next play, so under a minute to go with Tubbs and Bulware, and they're making a contribution. And now all of a sudden, the Seahawks, who unusually started slow, get Sean Alexander a nine-yard run. Watching the visitors' locker room <laughs> in that stadium. Then Sean Alexander doing what he does best into the end zone. Alexander, who earlier scored fumbling again at the one, but falling on it, bounces outside. And Alexander, touchdown. Now Seattle with breathing room. Won the, the big Monday night game. Now they had to fly all the way to Seattle. Sean Alexander, Seahawks home opener. Boy, did they look good in the first half, Tom. 47-0 Alexander. Marching band. 14-yard touchdown. He ran for 144 and fired up. Cardinals lead. All they do is kick field goals. They lead 3-0. Sean Alexander beginning a big day for Alexander's ragtime marching band. 25-yard touchdown. And then Alexander from the one, you know he's going to get yep. it. 24 to 9. Should equal in bounds. <laughs> with the score 24 12, the Seahawks to the ball at the 48. And, uh, Alexander with the spin. Whoop! Then backwards, then forwards. Look at him go. Woo! Through the secondary. Down to the seven yard line. 45 yard gain. Third and goal at the one. Alexander, his fourth touchdown of the game. And the Seahawks. Man, you go two and one in that division. We Redskins now in Stewing Drive, Seattle, second goal to Washington. Three. Sean Alexander thought it would be a tough uh, day for him. Back to the game in which Seattle is up 27, 21, second and three. Sean Alexander running hard off left tackle, shuns the Ram into the end zone. One of his two touchdowns, 34, 21, Seattle. He scored eight touchdowns in five games in his ESPN career. That's games on ESPN. He likes a well-ride leader, especially in stunning HD. First quarter, he will be popular. He's gonna be popular. Touchdown, Alexander. 141 yards rushing for the game he wasn't done later in the first. Cut it out. Seahawks, a franchise record, 320 yards rushing. And then your Visa Sky Cam, play of the game, 23-yard touchdown run. Alexander, four touchdowns in the game, only the second player in history to rush for four touchdowns in a game twice in a season. Seahawks roll 42 to 10. Moving the ball. Alexander. Nice cut back for 14 yards. He passes Chris Warren as the all yes, 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 the in his Hall of Fame reign at halftime. Sean Alexander having a Hall of Fame season. 17 rushing touchdowns already this year. Well, make it <laughs> Wow. That leads to another field goal. And then Alexander's red time marching band. Look at him down the field. 40-yard run. Who's going to get it at the one? Sean Alexander. It really is nice. <laughs> Home run says, let's go for it. Sean Alexander. NFC off their 42-0 win. Well, on Monday night in Philadelphia, Sean Alexander and the Seahawks looking to make it nine straight. Played a 49er team that got their attention because they played him to a two-point game earlier this year and get the Seahawks' attention. 21-3, up 31-3. Alexander's ragtime band. He now has 23 touchdowns 
has tied for six best. B follows his eyes right to the football. Sean Alexander running behind center Robbie Tobek, a touchdown, two yards. And they have some issues there, but we're playing football first quarter. No score. Seahawks and the Niners 24. They go Sean Alexander. He fumbles. The ball is loose. No one can get a handle on it. Like trying to corral it. And once again, Nate Burleson saves the day. And the next play, Alexander scored to make it 7-0. Seattle. On to the third quarter now. The Seahawks. Mentality, it's a mentality you've got to create it. And they're creating it out there. 17 nothing. they were up. Sean Alexander always plays so well against Arizona. Another touchdown run here on fourth and one. 18 carries, 70 yards. It's now a 17-14 lead. Huge hole, Mark. A huge hole. You crack the seam fourth and one. Let's face it. You're trying to get penetration. You're trying to get every gap. If you don't hit your gap, you're going to have that kind of hole. And then you one on the Cincy 36. And Sean Alexander follows his blocks perfectly. Gives him a huge first down. Rumbles for Look 14 yards. Look how hard yards. he's running, coach. And then 14 nothing. Seahawk ball, 14 yard line. Sean Alexander ran for 73 and ran in on this. 27 touchdown throws this season for Hasselbeck. That is a career high. Third.